In this tutorial, um, one of the things you'll notice is that we're already logged in. And how can you tell? Because you'll see the black and gray toolbar on the top. You'll see that the user that's logged in, you can log out. You also see the pages have you edit and clone content. And what I want to show you is the home page is a little bit different from the other pages in that it has more things happen. It has a different layout than the secondary pages. Secondary pages are very similar. The home page has probably more what we would call blocks. And what I'll show you now is that this is a block, this this here. So if we want to change this, the wording, the image, we can click into this. Blocks appear as little gears over sections. So there's the block for this, for social icons, for the menu, for the slogan. If you come over here for the temperature app, for the menus, um, this is the main content of this page. So you, you have to um, get to it. You want to hit edit. You want to click edit. Uh, and in the bottom as well, you have gears for this, the Mixer True logo, this middle section here, and this other section here. So the various ways you access um, content on the website is either through page editing the page, the main content on the page, or going to one of the gears and editing editing one of those gears um, so there's two things that are always happening on a website the main content which you can access through edit or in, in many of these other pages but mostly the home page is where you're gonna see blocks that you want, want to get access to and change things on um, be it um, this this one in the front here when we want to change this image out to something else but it, it looks amazing uh, or this is a block, but see, this is created by a view, and we'll talk about that in another um, tutorial. But so, and this block is actually just content, so that you can configure this to change the wording here. But this is a view that's created by various um, slides that are, are that make up this slideshow, and so you can edit either pages or blocks. And so that's the end of this tutorial.